How y'all doing everybody? My name is Devin and this is my channel, JD Dark Shadow. And right now, I'm using my new um, Blue Snowball Ice Mic. I got it uh, about a month ago, but I just now started tinkering with the settings and shit. So my audio settings are going to be changing like they always have. I'm trying to get it to the point where it's like really good, but I haven't found that threshold yet. I haven't found the perfect spot yet, so bear with me. But today, we're going to be playing Life is Strange. Now, I did start it up once just to see how it worked and got all the settings good, but I did not get far whatsoever. I just got a little bit into it. But I've always wanted to play Life is Strange, and um, it's been popular for a while, but I never looked anything into it, but I saw that it was on sale, so I'm going to go ahead and buy it. And I'll tell more about it once we get into it, but let's go ahead and start it. I notice I like to ramble at the beginning, and P uh, I don't like rambling, but apparently I do it a lot. Life is Strange is a story-based it's a story-based game that features player choice. The consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past. And I did not read the rest of that. Now, what? oh sweet Jesus. I'm using my Xbox controller and it's vibrating like crazy. Oh no, wake up! Oh, come on. Oh, sorry about that, guys. I thought I saw some. Hell, if I know. It was like you're in a storm. I'm trapped in a storm? How did I get here? And where is here? I don't know. I just started this. Look at outfit, though. There's the lighthouse. I'll be safe if I can make it there. I hope. Please let me make it there. Oh, cool. I'm into it. Okay. Okay, before we continue, let me just do some, uh audio is a little loud okay there we go that's much better okay right triggers run all right look at that god damn what the fuck that's a big ass storm and you don't know how you got here jesus christ I don't think that lighthouse is going to protect you now. I, uh, against that, I think the tornado is going to kick it, this lighthouse's ass. But damn, this game's already looking so good. Yeah. Fucking big. Sharknado! Imagine all kinds of fucking sharks through there. God damn, that'd be great. Oh, Jesus Christ, a boat? Run! Oh, you just dream. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. Yep. To shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Oh, right in the eye. God damn, that's a good shot. Who perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't and white. fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller? Weird. Diane Arbus. Huh. There you go. Let's Bueller. see. Why are um, you? let's look at this. Images of, look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. <laughs> laughing? No, that that looks really good. It kind of reminds me of of um um oh, God, what is it called? Um, the Netflix show with the lots Stranger Things, I believe. God damn, I, I can't think of it. It's gonna kill me not knowing the name of it. And it's very popular. Everybody loves it. It's it's about supernatural stuff. And there's like letters on the wall with flickering lights connected to it. Y'all probably know what it is. I can't think of it right now. I never watched it. I don't have Netflix. Oh, let's see. Oh, wait. Did I read that right? Take a selfie. Okay. I'm going to take a selfie. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. I could frame any one of you in a... I believe Max has taken what you kids call a 
Selfie. Yeah. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Yeah, I'm going to post on Instagram. You all know the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. <laughs> I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Mm -hmm. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Oh, yeah. Um, ask me because I'm just begging to talk to everybody. Uh, you're asking me? I did know. Uh, the left one kind of sounds kind of like a smart ass attitude. I'll just do, I did know. I did know, but I kind of forgot. Ooh, line level 100. Or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Damn, Daguerre chill. Louis was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Did you just say sad face? You bitch! Fuck you! God damn. Pencil case, photo. Let's read the journal. Ooh. What's all this? Oh, cool. Her name is Victoria. Nay, name of a bitch. If anybody named Victoria watching this, I'm truly sorry in advance. You're probably a wonderful person. Okay, there's Kay and Jefferson. Let's see. Episode one. Okay. Uh, let's see. The Blackwell Academy. Dad, Kate, Mom, and Warren. Okay, Dad. Have a very special 18th birthday. You're an adult now, and you're still our little girl. Oh, but you're still our little girl. Check your account. Don't blow it all at once. Oh, I got money? Ooh. Okay. Hey, Max, you around? Always. You okay? Did you want to get tea lighter today? Absolutely. I'll be free after four. TTYL. Mom. Happy birthday, Maxine. We can't even believe it's been 18 whole years since you you were brought to us. XO. Aw. Warren. Oh, okay. I have not replied to him. Do you want to meet for coffee after school? I need an excuse not to study. Oh, skipping on, on those academics, bro. Please. Make sure you check out Necromantic on my flash draft. Well, ha 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 ha. Hey, Mad Max, let's bust shit up. Oh, God. No wonder I'm not replying. Wait, I have to study for a physics test. So if we bust anything, it's going to have to be the... It has to... We also have to measure its velocity. Oh, God damn, dude. Oh, the cringe. Ah. Oh. Cringe. Oh, that was so bad. So bad. Don't ignore this message. Dude, I'm not going to message you. Oh, let's see. What else can I do? Oh, my bag. My little camera bag is battered, but still kicking. Yep. Ah, shit. Class is over. submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career. Ooh, she's cute. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor. Don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. <laughs> he is a serious teacher. Damn. Don't know if I fully like him, but I can, nothing I can do about it. Waste a second kissing ass. Ass, she is kissing. And just look at hers. God damn. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay, never mind. Let me just go off. Let me, what are you drawing a tablet? She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. $5,000! God damn! Jesus Christ, girl! Calm down! That's a lot of money. Hey, Kate. Hi, Kate. Oh. Oh, see the girl I was texting and stuff. Hope I didn't embarrass yeah, you. I hope I didn't embarrass you with my lame answer. It sucks to be dragged into the spotlight. Unless you're Victoria. She's got nothing on you, Max. Well, I should get going. Yeah, me too. Talk to you later. Uh, I'll see. You need to get going. 
You lying, bitch. How are we friends? What's this? Oh, I'll take a photo wherever that is. Why not? Why don't I have an iPhone? What time is this? What year is this? Huh. Anyways. Man, this is a cool room. Ooh, nice TV. Victoria. Mr. Jefferson. Oh, I gotta speak to him. Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, yeah, sir. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. Ooh. I never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Put the foot down. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Wow. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Wow, that was actually very inspirational. God damn, I thought he was a dick. Never mind. He's just a tough dude. Man, he even well, has a plasma HGTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Documentaries? Come on, watch Breaking Bad. All right, let's get out of here. You're super cute, whoever you are. Ah, oh, just cute? Special picture? Look at that cow. Moo! Moo! Ah, I feel so bad for that one. I'm sorry. <laughs> Squire Enix. God, I, I'm an asshole. The volume went down. Oh, she put in earbuds. I'm listening. Oh, I like this. Oh, this is cool. Uh, move, dude. Fucking cock. Okay, what was I doing? Oh, I think that was a girl. Or her name is Stella. Yeah, I think that was the one I said I thought was cute. Oh, so cute too. Oh, leave him alone. Y'all assholes. Huh. A lot of stuff. Oh, those were the ones with the special picture. Juliet. Trevor! Trevor, you're a dick. Who are you? God damn, your face looks like a horse. Samuel. Uh, Samuel is such a weirdo, but I kind of like that about him. Okay, strange. Um, let's see, what was I doing? I think I was going to bathroom. Yeah, <laughs> get out of the way, goddamn! People like to jump in front of you in this game. Why well, missing people posters? It looks like she's been gone for months. Huh. Wonder if this has anything to do with the actual game or not. Don't know. There's Hayden, another Vortex Club bro. But he's actually not an ass. Oh, okay. I guess Vortex people are asses. But um what I was saying about this game was I got this during Christmas break and um I've always wanted to try it out. I, I downloaded the first episode for free, but I feel like I was gonna play the first episode and really want it like really badly so I decided just to get them all all chapters so now let's finish this up oh yeah Good. oh shit nobody can see my meltdown except for me your meltdown oh yeah what I was gonna say was um I was wanting to do a let's play of um this game called Lucy the eternity she wished for and um also, I want to do a Let's Play of Undertale. I'm actually barely seeing anything of Undertale. Um, I actually try to ke uh, keep away from it so I wouldn't get too, like, spoiled on it and know everything and not, like, want to play it. 
So I have that game. I've been wanting to do Let's Play of it. So if you want to see uh, Let's Plays like that, just comment down below or, you know, like the video. Now who would bother to write that crap? Eh, someone who thinks they're a bitch. I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? The universe is taunting you? Eh, whatever you say. It was just a weird ass dream, I guess. I had a fond boat in it and a sarknado. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. You do have a gift. You take some really good photos. I really like that. Oh, come on! That was a really good photo! I liked it. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, bro, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Okay, I'll take this photo. Why not? Say cheese, motherfucker! Boom! Got ya! Okay, turn that in. Why not? Butterfly on dress. Wait, this is a girl's bathroom. Get out, dude. Dude, wrong bathroom. It's cool, Nathan. Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. Uh, okay. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Ooh, Man, I blackmail. Can headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am. Oh, what shit. Where did you get that? Shit got real. What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Uh oh. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away uh. from me, psycho. Oh, god damn. Ah. Uh. Right in the gut. Oh shit. I witnessed a murder. Oh, what the hell? What the fuck? The hell? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. Uh huh. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. Likely what? These pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. Yeah. From light to the fuck? From colors was that a dream? Being hassled again. And if Victoria Do I? Rings, this is real. Now, Shit. Can you oh no. Shit. I, I have to upgrade to an iPhone now. God damn. Okay. If I'm crazy, I might as well go all the way. Can I actually reverse time? Hold LT to rewind. The fuck? I did now, it. Can you I actually did it. How did you learn to do that? And how did you get these powers? Max, don't freak out. Not yet. Uh, taking our selfie, why not? Of her images of hope. When I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. Uh huh. Ooh, I can use the answer now. Yeah. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I do. I know I'm not dreaming this. It's real. I can tell. His beard looks like paint. Selfie expression. What if that girl isn't dead yet? The point Can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Or you got piss. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, RB to skip. Okay. I feel sick. I have to use the bathroom. I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. 
We can talk more after class. God damn it. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me he after class. And I need time to save that girl. You should have just answered it. You knew they answered. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Fuck you. Sad face to me. I'm giving the right answer. Okay, rewind. Da -na 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 -na. Oh god. Hold down RT to rewind faster! RB to skip. Yeah, yeah. Marian process. Invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830s. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. Yeah, eat that, bitch. Huh, fuck face. Bitch. It gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Oh my god, there's a lot of pages. I don't know if I got time to read all of this. Oh no. Uh, I might read this in like another episode. It would take way too long for me to read all of this. If y'all want to read this, you can either pause it or you can um, write down comments below and tell me that you want me to read this out and we'll go through it. But right now, I, I don't think I can. Nathan. Nathan's a dick. Rich family dude. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. <sighs> Come on, let me skip. can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Yep. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. <laughs> Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. I'm gonna be a hero. Victoria, you still have to do your homework. Even if you're Time to go save the blue. God damn it. Think about leaving here until we talk about your interest. Damn it. I'm sorry. I'd never let one of photography skip that. I'm not avoiding. I'm not avoiding, just biding time, waiting for the elusive right moment. That is true, folks. Exactly. Yeah, Max, basically. Don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Oh, thanks, dude. Press LB to quickly undo your previous action. Victoria, you still have to do your homework. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I hmm. talk to you for a moment? Yes. I, I kind of like that. No, Victoria. I didn't want to actually rewind that. I'd never let but I guess, you know, tell me what to do. Oh, okay. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Yay. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Thank you. You're my favorite teacher. I'll bring you an apple. See you, you fine ass bitch. All right, go to the bathroom. Go to the bathroom. Let's get out of here. Yeah, Fuck the music. The oh, I got plenty of time. Please. Dude, you better get out of my way. Think I'm crazy. Fuck you, nerd. I need the janitor's help. Me and him will beat the shit out of this rich kid. Okay, Max. Ooh, I like your shoes. Oh. Well, I actually looked at the bit sound first and looked at the mirror. No. You snap. Selfie. Now you waited. What are you going to do? I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Oh, Come fire alarm right there. Down. Tell me what to do. I need I'm a hammer to break it open. People trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Ah! Damn it! You are going to get in hella more trouble. For hammer! This. Hammer time, bitch! No way! Don't oh, right in the dick! Again, <laughs> You're welcome. I'm a hero. 
another shitty day. <laughs> Just another shitty day. <laughs> it's like this happened before. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. Wow. What the fuck is going on? I don't know. Do not freak out. Ah, don't worry. We got this. Let's get out here. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? Yeah. It means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Yeah. Girls always use that excuse. What? Excuse for what? Or I had to piss. But what? Is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then Your face is covered in shit. Pussy, or are you hiding something? Huh? God damn, dude. Madsen, the situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Thank you, principal. God, that guy was such a dick. Let me talk to you, principal. Can I? Yep. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm I witness a murder. I'm worried about my future. The sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You could always be up front with me, Max. It's really or nice. Have you done something wrong? Ah, oh, shit. Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Hide the truth or report Nathan. Oh, that is a huge decision. Okay, apparently. I don't know what would be the right thing to do. Nathan's a Ritz kid and shit. So he might have quite a bit of power. But the right decision would be to report him. Like in real life. Like you don't hide the truth from them. That is a serious thing. He is. He has mental issues. And he's carrying an armed weapon. If I didn't do this time travel shit. He would have killed that blue haired chick. So, like, he's honestly, you know, a very hazardous... It's... If I don't report this, other people's lives could be at risk because I didn't do nothing. So that's my logic in this, so I'm reporting to this. I Got any tell tell? Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes! He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family. And one of Blackwell's most honored students. So? It's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girl's bathroom. He's fucking crazy. So what happened next? Then, then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office please go outside with the rest of your class now miss carfield all right now i call me jerks have consequences won't do anything since the prescott family owns blackwell now should i rewind and change my story rewind and change the story no 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 that was the right thing to do i don't care if they own this fucking school or whatever that was a serious thing. I'm leaving that. Fuck it. I hope the guy goes to prison. I hope they find the gun. I hope they find drugs and find everything on him. Like I'm going to change my fucking answer. How dare they? Da -da -da. Ooh, this is very calm and peaceful. Ooh. Oh, uh, getting busted, bitch. Ooh. Well, Miss Grant, you look nice. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Uh, sure, why not? Sure, you seem nice. For you. What's the petition? 
David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. Also, this is a high school. That's crazy. I get why school should be on high alert these days, but cameras in the dorm rooms. Oh, yeah, that's it's like crazy. Smoke. And it's up to you and your classmates to stand up here. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. You know a lot about Blackwell for being the science teacher. Science is history, Max. And I have a secret wish to teach local lore and legends. Really? There's a lot of unique facts about this you might really enjoy discovering. Oh. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, Will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Yeah, I'll sign it. Absolutely. Because. But not pure surveillance. Yeah, I basically. You were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Yeah, because. This action will have consequences. My ass, I'm not. I don't give a shit. Like, having, like, security surveillance in the actual dorm rooms, that's a little weird. Like, to me, because I think that's a little step too far. Like, I can, I understand, like, in the school, in the hallways and shit, because, you know, that's a little bit understandable, but, no, there, there's a point where it becomes a little too strong, you know? A fountain, I can sit down. Uh, nah, I don't want to sit down. This is a great image. All those rippling green coins. I hope everybody, I better read Warren's text before he... Uh, well, see it. Okay, fine. Uh, how do I check it? Okay, I better oh. get to my dorm and go. Well, God damn it! I didn't get to read it. Hold up. Okay. Uh, let's see. Hi, Max. Can you get my flash drive? I need some info and space. Hello? Sorry, running late. It's insane day. I'll meet you in the lot. Looking cool. You'll see. My camera will be ready. See you shortly. Hope so. All right. Flash drive. All right. I guess I have to get the flash drive out of my dorm room. Open my journal. A lot of pages. Oh, there's 12 pages. Jesus Christ. That is a lot of stuff. Ooh, squirrel. Oh, I can't get close to you. You're a lucky son of a bitch. All right. I think this... Let's see. Okay, that's um, another part of the school, and that's the dorms. I didn't know they had dorms for high school. Well, where I live, they don't. We have dorms for, like, college and stuff. Hell, the college I'm going to is just a community college, and it doesn't have no dorm rooms. I take online classes. All right, let's go dorms and get this flash drive. Oh, this looks like a really nice school. Hell, it looks like a college. Woo! Catch that football. All right. All right, and we'll do that. Looks like they're uh, doing some editing, or <laughs> editing, some, um, like, fixing up and painting and shit. Can I get by, Victoria? God damn it, I have to go through her. Oh, look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. Selfie hoe? Fuck you! What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> hey, meds are a good thing. Bitch. Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh. Hold up, hose. So original. That's a Still fast picture. Fast. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? <laughs> oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. <laughs> okay, I, I, I'll have to mention, she's a bitch and all, but go fuck your selfie. That was kind of funny. That was clever. Um, oh, hey, creepy dude. You want to help me? There goes Samuel Da Vinci to paint the window. Paint the window? I don't like the borders and stuff. Um, hmm. 
Looks like it's sprinkling. Uh, what am I gonna do? Oh, sprinklers. I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Oh, okay. I'm guessing I do that here. Oh, right there. Man, that was easy. Let's use it. The fuck? He disappeared. It's a ghost. Ah! The hell? It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look apparently a lot. I can't even chill on the steps. Okay, time to go up on the steps. Oh, you're not a ghost. I'm watching your ass, freaky person. Do you understand English? What? Get lost. Well, shit. Well, fuck. What do I do now? Um. Yeah, some. It sold that paint. It sold that bucket. I think. It sold something with him. Oh, it's selling me right now. I must have missed something. I should rewind. Do, do, do. Keep going. Huh. I might have to mess with the bucket before I do anything. Come on. Okay. Oh, I do. Oh. Oh, he's walking over. Hurry. Hurry. Okay, let's see if Spooky ghost. Okay, let's turn on the sprinkler to see what's happens. What the hell? Haha. <laughs> Nope, not at all. Victoria, it's just water. Yeah, it's just water. God damn. Water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. More than a car. On the set. All right, now let's see what happens with the paint bucket. Now I'm more worried about the dude disappearing. Yeah. No way. No <laughs> Got jizz done. Wait, wait, pain is not good for hair. No. Nope. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Oh, uh, poor Samuel. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Oh yeah, bitch. Hey, <laughs> you got jizz all over you. That's what you get. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I had just all of you. Make fun of or comfort. Ah, shit. Uh, always be the better person, okay? Like, don't stoop to their level. Always be the better one. So, I'm going to comfort them, even though they've been a bitch to me, and I did that to them. That's the right thing I to do. Sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there'll be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. Aww. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. <laughs> you deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck yourself. Nah, that was funny. That was mean, but pretty funny. <laughs> see, she gets it. One of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Au revoir. Thank you. See, being the better person worked out. Now I'm not mad at her. You probably played me. I should have played her. No. Why do you keep what? My room before I find Warren. <sighs> Quit second guessing yourself. Calm down. I'm determined. Okay, man. There's a lot of rooms here. Taylor is a slave. Oh God. Run, bitches! Run! It's going to be pissed we took so long. 
Ah, oh, she's already pissed. Just watch out. <laughs> okay, which one's my room? Uh, Max's room. Oh, there it is. That was easy. Oh God, what happened to that bear's eye? Home sweet home, my favorite cocoon. Favorite cocoon. Ooh. Oh, this is actually a pre. Oh, so that's where you took the photo. Man, you really personalize your room here. Ooh. Oh, I got something for mom. Mom! Max, your principal sent me an email saying that you told some tall tales about Blackwell Honor Student. Is that true? The principal said that this was a serious false charge and that he's worried that you're telling stories. Call me ASAP so we can talk about this. Mom. It was true! He was waving a fucking gun! God, he must have keistered it or something. God damn. Lie down, cushion. Teddy bear. I won't look at Teddy bear. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. Captain! When I followed your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER. I knew it was gone forever. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. I won't look at this. Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. Wow. That looks w I love the lights, too. Nice. What's in here? Underwear? <sighs> nope. Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiots. Oh, calm down. It'll be okay. Oh. I saw a guitar. Let me look at that. Oh, I get to play it? Oh, wicked! Oh, you're really good, Max. Oh, you're really good at playing guitar. This sounds so good. Oh, I just want to sit here and just listen to this full thing. But I can't, unfortunately, because that's all the time I have for this episode, guys. So, um, if y'all enjoyed that, you know, this... Just be patient. I'm coming out for part two of this very soon. Oh, this this was really good. Uh, I'm kind of, the one thing I don't like about this so far... Oh, like, don't get me wrong. I love all this so far. This was really good. I love the characters and all this stuff. The well, one thing I did not like was how she suddenly discovers she has time traveling powers. That was uh, really weird. It came out of nowhere. Which kind of happened a little bit more naturally... But, hey, what can you do? But other than that, this is all cool. I wonder who's the blue hair chick. Um, I really love her, like, design. She seems like a punk chick or, yeah, like a punk or emo or something like that. But anyways, while we're sitting here listening to the guitar, I guess that'll be it, guys. Um, come back in part two where we get this flash drive and bring it back to the that dick. I already forgot his name. Was, was it Matthew or something? I don't know. But if y'all enjoyed the video, Detroit, smash that subscribe button and like and like and share the video. That would uh, I really appreciate that. And I'll see y'all next time. See ya.